What is motor neuron disease or MND? MND is a disease of the central nervous system that attacks the nerves in the brain and spinal cord that ultimately control all voluntary muscle movement. In some parts of the world, like in the USA and Europe, the disease is known as amyotrophic lateral sclerosis or ALS. The estimated lifetime risk of being diagnosed with MND is 1 in 350 for men and 1 in 400 for women. The disease can affect anyone. Every day in Australia, at least two people are diagnosed with MND and every day at least two Australians die because of MND. There is currently no truly effective treatment available and no known cure. As the disease progresses, patients gradually lose the ability to control and move their muscles, leading to weakness and eventually complete paralysis. However, these changes are gradual, usually taking place over a few years. The symptoms can be quite subtle at first, and the disease affects every patient differently, which can make it difficult to diagnose initially. In some patients, the first signs of MND is muscle weakness or a lack of motor control in the arms or legs. For example, the person may find that they trip easily when walking, even on a flat surface, or have difficulties doing subtle hand actions, such as doing up buttons, or typing on their mobile phone, or writing with a pen or pencil. For other people, the first symptoms may be slurring of the speech or difficulty swallowing due to weakness of muscles in the mouth, throat and tongue. Very occasionally, some patients' first symptoms may be difficulties with breathing and shortness of breath due to weakness of the diaphragm and other breathing muscles. In rare cases, patients may also experience uncontrolled bouts of laughter or crying even though they don't really feel happy or sad. None of these symptoms by themselves means a person has MND. They could be symptoms of another illness or could mean nothing at all. Anyone could be clumsy or tongue-tied or out of breath at times. If the symptoms are due to MND though, the patient will experience a gradual progression and worsening of symptoms and the muscle weakness will spread to other parts of the body. If you do have any of these symptoms, talk to your GP and ask for a specialist neurologist referral. MND is hard to diagnose and many other diseases must be ruled out first. Even if you're given a diagnosis of MND, it is recommended that you get a second opinion. If you or someone you know has been diagnosed with MND, you can get help and support. Talk to your neurologist about services available in your state. The Cure for MND Foundation is determined to fight MND. We are Australia's leading independent MND foundation and the largest independent funder of MND research and clinical trials in Australia. Our strategic research initiatives fund large-scale collaborative research projects in the lab, new drug development and clinical trials around Australia. We also fund the purchase of new vital assistive equipment for Australians currently living with MND, such as powered wheelchairs, ventilators and cough assist machines, and advanced communication aids such as eye gaze technology. If you would like to help the Cure for MND Foundation raise awareness and funds for research into finding a cure, contact us today.